let's say it's like a, I don't know, 25 centimeters, whatever, I, I keep it in the upper esophagus. <clears throat> and then what I will do is I'll just kind of um, hand it to the nurse. So I'll have them hold, yep, and then hold it here. Yep. And I'll just have them, let's say it's at 25, I'll say just keep it there at the mouth, at 25 centimeters. I'll then either, this is kind of awkward because we did it this way, but usually I've kind of already stepped around um, the scope. So I could, what I could do is just kind of go underneath it. Got it. Do, yep. I pass it to them. So that would be before you pass it. Before mm -hmm. I pass it, then I hand it to them. They're holding it with two hands um, at the upper esophagus. And I'll take the uh, Bravo for the tech. And so sometimes I'll have to maybe move the scope just a little bit with my hand, but then what I'll do is I'll put the Bravo down with the scopes off to the side, and then I'll put it down to where it's marked. Um, let's say this is marked at like 35. Along the way, I'm looking at the screen, so I should see that Bravo go past the screen. Um, and that's the whole point is to visualize it's going down the right way. Once I have it in the right place, let's say at 35. <clears throat> so this is where I will do this all myself. So, and I'm, you want me to do this? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Actually pop it? Yep. So I'll show you how I do this with one hand. Um, I don't know if you want to get more of a close up with this. Yep. So this is the safety device. Um, <clears throat> So we do the suction for 30 seconds, and then once they call at the time, or once I see that it's been 30 seconds, I will pop this off. And I got a nice effect because it pops off very. And then on the side, what I'm gonna do is pull this down with my thumb on the side and then flick it this way. It only mm -hmm. needs to go a quarter turn clockwise, so it's, it's actually will pop. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna push down, flick it, and that's it. Nice. So you kind of, I kind of feel the pop when I do that, and as long as it's kind of loose there. Then what I will do is have them turn off suction. Um, I'll look at the screen. I will then pull it out, kind of verify that indeed it popped off. Sorry, I should have verified that I wasn't gonna hit the hand there. Um, and then I will take the scope back from the nurse at this point, and just go down, just and it's only gonna take five, 10 centimeters. Mm -hmm. I'll go down, verify it's in place, I come out, I'm done. Great, thank you. Yep.